all right welcome to the second episode of the road to being a successful founder yep i came up with the name and i love it i don't care what you think about it so what are the updates it's been about a week since the last episode and we started coding and so i'm really happy that we started coding i'm super excited to finally get into the part of the project or the part of the app that i'm going to be creating that feels a little bit more familiar so the marketing side of it creating all all the advertisements or thinking about what I have to do for advertising, doing UI designs, that is not my forte. So this is definitely more like home to me since I'm a software engineer and I'm gonna do my best. I am going to try and finish as much as I want to possibly do within a week. I also don't know if I want to go for a weekly frequency, but I feel like this is a good way to just keep track of my progress. And it also pushes me to want to do more content and to work harder towards having something to talk about every single week. So we're going to try this. We're going to try to do it once a week, make it a weekly thing. And that's currently where I'm at. We started a GitHub repository. So that seemed like the easiest way to have a free place to put our code and to have a pretty clean UI for understanding understanding the commit history, as well as coming up with our own task board that's also on GitHub. So it's side by side and integrated and it helps keep everything in one place in terms of the coding portion of it. We also automated a weekly bot on Discord and this is a way to just have our weekly meetings, but also to not have to worry about all of the logistics of setting up a thread and figuring out what we need to talk about. It kind of preps us. So a thread message on Discord goes out and hour before a meeting and it gives me time to just think what do we need to do as the PM slash lead UI designer slash lead software engineer and so I only have one other person working with me but I still have to lead that person and I still have to act as a founder and wear multiple different hats as I try to find my way towards being a founder so anyway it's going well I don't have any updates for now there's a lot less moving parts and I know that there's going to be more moving forward but right now it's just coding and hustling and making sure that we can get these things done as fast as we can. We estimated that the first few parts that we're working on, which is the homepage, are going to be done within the next two weeks because we're also learning the coding language from scratch. We're learning Flutter. If you didn't watch the last video, you can watch that. It kind of talks about a little bit of the premise of what I'm doing. But overall, I think Flutter is going to make it a lot easier to code on different platforms and having only one code base repository. We don't have to code specifically for iOS and then code in a different language for Android. I also learned a lot of things about Flutter since I started doing a little bit of foundational work and it's a little complicated understanding widgets, understanding the UI aspect of it, and also understanding how to incorporate business logic. I thought that everything in Flutter had to be a widget and I don't know why I thought that. I, <laughs> I, I don't know. It was just the way the tutorials ended up showing the information and I know that they were just trying to show off widgets widgets, but it made me think that everything needed to be in a widget, which confused the heck out of me. But now I'm on the right track. Everything is in a widget tree and I can talk about that in a little bit more detail. But um, I think just for now, just kind of explaining that I'm starting to understand more about Flutter and things are starting to come together is very exciting and it makes me super happy because I made some progress and we're just going to keep it up. We're going to keep the energy up and we're just going to keep going. So I'm going to keep going. Thank you all for watching. I appreciate you as you guys come along on this journey. If you want to support me, if you want me to keep doing these, feel free to like, feel free to comment and subscribe. And as always, keep improving, stay productive, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.